Okay, so let's now use those laws that we just learned to actually simplify our calculations so we don't have to write out all the terms going from 4 up to 90 but we can actually just use the laws that we've learned so far okay so the first one that I'm going to do is I'm first going to see okay well inside here I've got two terms so I can just split it up into two so I can have my sum going from my index 4 to 90 of 2 minus the sum of I going from 4 to 90 of 3i okay so this one I can almost do immediately I see I've got that constant term there's no um, i's in there which means I just need to multiply 2 with the number of terms there's going to be so to go from 4 to 90 how many terms do we have okay don't make the mistake of saying there's 86 terms because because then you're just saying 90 minus 4 okay that's kind of alright but the problem is you're not counting 4 remember you're subtracting 4 which means 4 is not also being counted you should only subtract 3 because I does not take the value uh, 1 2 and 3 so we're only subtracting 3 or just another way of looking at it is multiply with B minus A which is 90 minus 4 plus 1 Okay, for this one, we see, okay, that constant, that 3 can come in front, in front, and then inside here, we have the sum of i going from 4 to 90 of just i. And here we see that core formula that, that Mr. Gauss used uh, when he was in grade 1, not that he learned that formula. But, okay, so let's see, 90 minus 4, that's 83, uh, sorry, no, 86, 87 terms times 2 is 174 minus 3 times now here we can use Mrs. Mr. Gauss's idea so let's take the last plus the first so it's 90 plus 4 okay and multiply that by the number of terms divided by 2. In other words, how many pairs will we have that adds up to 94? Well, from 90 to 4, we will have, and we said 87 terms, but they will be grouped in pairs of 2. So there we go. So just to simplify this now a little bit to make the calculation a bit easier, okay, 90 plus 4 is 94. times 87 divided by 2. I'm just going to use the calculator, why not? Okay. Well, there's probably good reasons why not. 173 minus 3 times 94 times 87 divided by 2. And the final answer I get is negative 12094. Just confirm. There we go, negative 12, 0, 9, 4. Cool, that's the only example I'm going to do. I think the um, idea is quite clear, and uh, if you go and practice a few, you should be quite fine. Well, good luck.